हेलो एवरीवन इन दिस वीडियो लेक्चर वी विल स्टडी द टॉपिक वर्क मेजरमेंट मेथड एंड वर्क स्टडी ऑफ द दिस आर द टॉपिक्स ऑफ द सब्जेक्ट ह्यूमन रिसोर्स प्लानिंग एंड डेवलपमेंट सो लेट स्टार्ट विद द वीडियो लेक्चर इन दिस वीडियो लेक्चर फर्स्ट वी विल स्टडी वर्क स्टडी सो वर्क स्टडी हैज़ द डायरेक्ट रिलेशनशिप विद विथ प्रोडक्टिविटी इट इज़ मोस्ट फ्रिक्वेंटली यूज टू इनक्रीज द अमाउंट प्रोड्यूस फॉर अ गिवन क्वान्टिटी ऑफ रिसोर्स विथ लिटिल और नो फर्दर कैपिटल इन्वेस्टमेंट सो बेसिकली द टर्म वर्क स्टडी इज़ रिलेटेड टू द इंक्रीज इन द प्रोडक्टिविटी ऑफ ऑर्गेनाइजेशन विथ लिटिल और द नो फर्दर कैपिटल इन्वेस्टमेंट सो अदर इज दैट द डेफिनेशन गिवन बाय बी एस ग्लॉसरी ही डिफाइंस दैट The work study is a generic term for those techniques, particularly method study and work measurement, which are used in the examination of human resource, uh, of of human work in all its contexts, and which lead systematically to the investigation of all the factors which affect the efficiency and economy of situation being reviewed in order to effect improvement. So this is the definition given by the B S glossary. next we will study that the work study includes the two techniques under the work study so the first one under this is method study so method study uh, is that uh, or the, that just to simplify the job and develop the more economical method of doing that job and the second thing is work measurement which determines the standard time of performing that job so that after using these two techniques the higher productivity of organization can be achieved so the work study basically includes the two techniques method study and work study so what is method study the method study is the systematic recording and critical examination of existing and the proposed way of doing work as a means for developing and applying easier and more effective method and reducing the cost so this is the definition of work study uh, method study given by british standard institution now the second one under the under this is work measurement work measurement is an application of techniques designed to establish the time for a qualified workers to carry the, to carry out a specified job at a de, at a defined level of performance so this is about uh, this is the uh, work measurement so in general we can say that the method study means that we will generally simplify the job and develop the most economic method of doing that job so that the hum, uh, so that our productivity can be enhanced and the second one that is work measurement in this the standard time for doing doing a particular work is defined so that there must be no delay in uh, de delay in uh, de in time of performing a work by an employee and uh, the so that higher productivity can be achieved in the organization so the work study is an efficient because it is a systematic both in its investigation of problem being considered and also the development of its solution now there are the eight basic steps in the work study first one under this is select so select the job or the process which is to be studied now second is record so record the direct observation everything that happens so that the data will be available in the most convenient form to be analyzed next is examine examine uh, uh, the recorded facts critically uh, critically and challenge everything uh, that is done considering in turn uh, the purpose of activity the place where it is done the sequence in which uh, it is done the person who is doing it and the means by which which it is done now the fourth step is develop so develop the most economic method taking into the uh, into account all the circumstances of the organization now the uh, fifth step is measure now measure the quantity of work and uh, work involved in the method selected and calculate the standard time for doing it now the uh, sixth one is define so define the new method and the related time so that it can always be identified now the seventh step is install so install the method so uh, so agreed standard practices with the time allowed and the last one is maintain uh, maintain the new standard practices by proper a uh, control procedure so under this step 1 2 and 3 occurs in every study step 4 this is 1 2 and 3 occurs in every study and 4 is the method study technique and 5 calls for 
uh, work measurement and in this way your uh, our step of work study uh, is done so work study is basically uh, a, a valuable tool for the management so it uh, it means that it it is uh, it is for raising the productive efficiency of the factory it is a systematic method of doing the things it it is a more accurate means of setting the standard of performance it is a tool which can be applied everywhere in the organization and also it has some universal application in the organization now next we will study uh, method study so method study so definition of method study is study which is given by british standard institution is that the method study is a systematic recording and critical examination of existing and proposed way of doing work as a mean for developing and applying the easier and more effective method and reducing cost so method study involves breaking down the operation into its component or elements as their systematic analysis can be properly done so therefore the right attitude of human resource or the employed is very important who is going to perform method study that there must be a desire and determination of human resource uh, or uh, employee to produce the proper result uh, the hr must have the ability to achieve the result or hr must understood the human factors involved in performing the activity so method study has an application not only in a factories or industries its application can be done in the service sector also it can be applied in the offices hospital banks and other types of organization now next we will study objectives of method study so the first objective is that it lead to the improvement in if efficiency of labor it improved layout and design of workplace it improved and efficient work proce procedures effective utilization of man machine and material it help in improvement in design specification of final product it is necessary to decide the best sequence of doing the things in the organization it helps in improvement of working condition of the of uh, working conditions of uh, of employees or a labor in the organization and hence the labor efficiency can be improved it reduces the monotony of work of labors it reduces the manufacturing cost and thus reducing the cycle time of production in the organization now the last topic that is work measurement we will study here uh, so un, uh, so work work measurement so it, it is the application of techniques designed to establish the time for a qualified workers to carry out at a spe, at a specified job at a defined at a definite level of performance so this is about the work measurement means basically to de define the standard time for performing a particular job so here are some objectives of work measurement that is comparing the alternative methods of doing the things in the organization now planning and control of uh, planning and control of uh, time of working the things by the by the employees next is financial incentive schemes delivery date of goods can be uh, can be uh, Uh, can be uh, can be known in advance cost reduction cost control identifying the substandard worker that is to find out the problems of substandard worker and try to remove that problem and training of new employees in the organization now we will study the steps in work measurement so there are uh, basically six steps in work measurement so the first step under this is select select the work to be studied means in this is the work which is to be studied that is whose standard of uh, standard time is to be determined can be studied uh, can be selected under the first step second one record all the relevant data related to that uh, that job then after examine the de examine exam under this stage we will examine the data de in detail format and then critically analyze the data and then the fourth step is measure in this step the quantity of work involved is measured uh, in the particular job next after compile that is the standard time for the operation can be compiled and it is compared with an actual time and and then so that the standard time of performance can be uh, can be defined for the particular particular job now the next uh, uh, next or the last step is define so in the last step the series of activities and methods of operation or operation of doing a particular thing or a particular job can be defined defined in the uh, work measurement 
तो वर्क मेजरमेंट कैन बी कैटेगराइज इन टू वेरियस कैटेगरीज दैट इज इट मे बी अ रिपिटेटिव वर्क और इट मे बी नॉट रिपिटेटिव वर्क सो ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ दैट द प्रोसीजर कैन प्रोसीजर ऑल दिस प्रोसीजर कैन बी फॉलोड फॉलोड टू फाइंड आउट द स्टैंडर्ड टाइम फॉर परफॉर्मिंग अ पर्टिकुलर जॉब नाउ थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर लिसनिंग इट वेरी पेशेंटली